In today's Species Spotlight, we'll be looking at the Stores Monitor. It is a small terrestrial monitor that gets to about 15 to 20 centimeters snout to vent length. Its natural habitat is the arid zones of Australia, where it's often very hot and dry. So that's why I have to keep in mind when I'm setting up its enclosure. The setup is fairly straightforward. What I have is a background that allows it to climb around and a few pieces of wood so that its natural behaviors could be stimulated. And the substrate used is red desert sand. This particular piece of wood is probably the most important thing in the enclosure. It is hollow so it allows the monitor to bask and to be able to retreat. To heat the monitor up, I use a Halogen 35 watt dam light, which requires a transformer. This particular orientation of the wood allows me to create a basking spot of 39 to up to 45 degrees. Other features of this enclosure includes a pile of driftwood and a skull, which are also very important enrichments for the monitor. I also regularly supplement my monitor with calcium powder and other vitamins. I like to feed my monitor every 2-3 to three days, with Woody's being the staple diet, but I also add kangaroo mints every now and then. In terms of meat, I personally prefer feeding kangaroo mints and turkey mints because they contain lower levels of fat compared to pork and beef. Some people say that the stores monitor can be a bit more aggressive, especially around feeding compared to the other small monitors, so maybe just keep that in mind when you're considering stocking more than one stores monitor together. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Species Spotlight. Let me know down in the comments below if you'd like to see more videos like this.